Ladies and gentlemen, the recall was for a horse who was scoring out of position in behind the starting gate. There will be a reformation, and they'll be at the gate again shortly. It's post time for the fifth race, second division of the historic cup for the three-year-old Colt and Gelding Trotters, and Chasing Tail is off stride. Number four, Chasing Tail is on a break. And they're off Cigar Bar and his stablemate Grey Goose, both trotting out together toward the lead. Cobal came away smoothly in third. Danish Delight is fourth in between horses. Choco Chip in over three wide early on the turn. Mr. Commissioner sixth on the inside. Then it's Molded Pine who backs off seventh. Prize victory is eighth and a costly break from Chasing Tail. He's far behind and trailing the field as they trot around the opening turn moving toward the quarter. It's Cigar Bar who's comfortably in front and his stablemates are second and third. The opening quarter, 28 and 2. Now Choco Chip Hanover brushes up on the outside, and he takes the lead. And Matinas is out and rolling with Cobal, and Cobal is now third and coming on toward the front. Grey Goose set in. He's been shuffled just a bit in fourth. Then it's Danish Delight in fifth. Mr. Commissioner six. Molded Pine is on a break. Prize victory has moved up seventh. And Chasing Tail far behind, trailing the field. And Cobal's challenge is rebuffed by Choco Chip Hanover as they reach the half in 56 and 2. Cobal backed off a bit. He's just sitting on the outside right now in second. Cigar Bar trotting third. Grey Goose on the inside fourth. Danish Delight is tipped out, looking to make some progress on the outside. Mr. Commissioner is following him. Prize victory at the rail is seventh. Then it's Molded Pine and Chasing Tail. And with three eights to go, it's Choco Chip Hanover continuing to lead it. Cobal is now a length and a half off his wheel, racing in second. Cigar Bar skimming the pylons third. Three quarters in 125 and three. And they come to the top of the stretch. Choco Chip Hanover drifting just a bit, but he's drawing away. Mr. Commissioner with some late trot is circling up quickly on the outside. Cobal is there toward the rail. Grey Goose is racing in fourth. It's Choco Chip Hanover. Mr. Commissioner closing steadily as Choco Chip Hanover drifts out but leads it. Cobal is racing in second. They're coming down to the line. Choco Chip Hanover to win it. Cobal second. Mr. Commissioner third in 154 and two fifths. Ladies and gentlemen, returning to the winner's circle, 1B, Choco Chip Hanover. Three-year-old pine chip out of chocolate layered by Valley Victory owned by Bob Waxman of Ancaster, Ontario, trained and driven by Jan Johnson. Choco Chip Hanover, 154 and 2, a maiden-breaking effort for him this evening and a new stakes record in the historic cup, the old mark set back in 1994 by Mr. Levesque and Jimmy Tactor of 154 and 3. Tonight it's Choco Chip Hanover with the upset in 154 and 2. The historic cup here has gone to Choco Chip Hanover, owner Bob Waxman on my left, Jan Janssen, trainer and driver. Jan, coming into the race, this horse had shown some breaks, but last start had a solid trotting mile. Did you change anything going into his last start? Yeah, because uh, three weeks ago we were in Kentucky with him, the elimination for the, for the um, Kentucky the pace, uh, Spring Championship. And we didn't have Charlie Hobbins on, you know, we never had him on before, so, but he made a break and so I said, you know, he's, and the horse has ability. But you have to be so careful with him, so but uh, so let's put him on and see what happens. And okay. After that, when he's so, you know, now you can drive him. Okay. Today you got some pressure here coming from Cobol coming to the half. Tell us what you were thinking there. Yeah, you know, you know the horse was strong, you know. So I didn't, you know, he's best when he gets going. So I didn't want to let him go and see what he's going to do. Stakes record here. He didn't race as a two-year-old. What was the reason for that? He had an OCD and a stifle we took out in the, in the middle of the year. Five weeks from tomorrow is a Hamiltonian. Is this a possible Hamiltonian type horse? We'll take one day at a time here. Okay, Jan Janssen, Bob Waxman, what did you see when you bought Choco, Choco Chip Hanna? What did you like about him? Well, he was a beautiful pine chip colt. He was out of a uh, very good Valley Victory mare, and he was one of the most beautiful pine chip colts that uh, I believe sold two years ago. You're not supposed to see uh, horses breaking a maiden 54 and change here. What, what, the, the Choco Chip Hanna just exploded tonight. What, what was the story? Yeah, he's always had ability, and like John said, uh, we quit with him very early as a two-year-old, did an operation that was uh, necessary, according to Dr. Bramlage, and uh, he's come back very well this year, especially his last couple starts. Were you satisfied with Yankee Mustang's debut earlier? Oh, very satisfied. He hasn't had the uh, work that this horse has had, and it was a good uh, starter for him, having missed last week's qualifiers. How about Greg Goose? Is he handbow material? Uh, I, you know, we'll have to see. He also is uh, Ontario Sire Stake eligible, so we'll probably go up there and catch a few of those and see uh, how he looks uh, sometime uh, end of July. Okay, Bob Waxman, always a fixture among the trotting stakes here at the Meadowlands. Jan Janssen, congratulations, a historic cup.